Now Sports with Sports Director Scott Lever. North Boone's softball team has one more game to go this season, and it's as big as it gets. The Vikings will be playing for a Class 2A state championship tomorrow in Peoria. That's because they won their semifinal game today against Downstate Auburn. It was a pitcher's duel to start off this one. Auburn's Mina Taylor striking out the North Boone side. And then North Boone's Cami Carter did the same. She strikes out the side. So Taylor then added three more Ks in the second inning to clear the side again. So we're still scoreless now as we jump ahead to the fourth inning. And then Lauren Steffick did this, demolishing a pitch for a solo homer. The Vikings led one to nothing. Then with the bases loaded and no outs in the bottom of the frame, North Boone's defense comes up big. Carter makes a play off the bunt, tosses to Danny Goodman, and she fires to Sydney Goodman for the out of first to keep Auburn off the board. In the seventh now, it's Danny Goodman roping it out to left field. That makes the warning track. Another run scored to make it 2 to nothing. Vikings. Carter then slammed the door, closing this one out with another pair of strikeouts. North Boone wins 2 to nothing to advance to the 2A state championship game tomorrow. I can't even. I, I'm so in love with this team. So much love goes around. I think we're playing for each other right now, and I just hope we can keep it up. I just wanted to do something little just to get us going because we didn't have a good at first at bat. So I just wanted to get something going for us, and once I hit it, it was just huge for us. I can't even put this into words. I mean, we're, you know, like I said, from the start of this thing, you know, from the start of the pole season run, it's just it's a really special group, and I'm just so excited to just be along for the ride. North Boone will be playing Carterville in the championship game tomorrow. That will be played at 4.30 at the same location in Peoria. The Vikings going after their first state championship. So good luck, ladies.